Good afternoon, you guys. I am Anastasia. You can follow me on Instagram as the Extra Ass Planner. Please like, subscribe, and comment below. Please, I'm gonna flip this video, so I'm trying to just show. I'm sorry, I'll probably try to edit that um, out. And I will be having a tripod within the next week or so, so just bear with me so that way I can come with more videos, probably makeup tutorials, because y'all, this lighting right here is just bomb. Dot com. I didn't know. I mean, and I've been struggling in this room because this is my mom's old room. I've been struggling in this room trying to get my makeup done. But anyways, besides the point, these are five nineteen with tax here in Texas. I don't know if the taxes vary by state. Um, and that's after the forty percent off coupon. There was another brand, um, but my coworker had bought that brand's just regular metal, um, regular watercolor. She said they were pretty chalky, so I just wanted to try one that was a little bit different. So these are what the colors look like. I'll just bring that up close. This is kind of my fave, and this one right here. Um, that purplish pink is the purple metallic, um, and then this right here. They call it the light green metallic. And then this is so funny because this is the hookers green metallic. Okay, hookers, gotta everybody needs love too. Um, and then yeah, these right here, I've already swatched these at work and I'm gonna show y'all what they look like dry because in this video, of course, they won't be dry. These right here are so pigmented, y'all. Even this yellow, it's, I mean, a little goes a long way, legit, with these two colors. Um, and this is kind of popping out, and it's bothering me. There. Uh, these two, this black is really pretty, and I really like this one right here. But I'm just going to jump right in. I'm going to show them what, I'm going to show y'all what they look like um, without any color watercolor pencils like i said see these adorn it watercolor pencils my mama got those at the houston quilt show last year for me and i've been kind of putting them a little to use since i became a planner girl um so that way you know i can continue to get stuff because i'm actually using it so the first set like i said i'm just going to show y'all what they look like now i do use my adorn it um watercolor brush instead of this little janky brush for one because yeah look at it so I don't use that but it did come and I've seen some other ones at Hobby Lobby that kind of came with a um, watercolor brush in them they were a little bit more expensive but not too much especially with a coupon so I just like to squeeze a little bit and get the bristles wet um, and I kind of even though it is you know already dirty it does not show up at all it does not have a problem with blending but here we go guys i'm just gonna hop right in so i'm just gonna start with the black metallic and y'all i'm not like i said i'm not a watercolor queen but i'm trying i, I can ombre and we're trying this lettering thing and i hope y'all can see that let me just scoot that down so i'm gonna try Y'all, I'm probably just honestly just going to do A's. But see how I think that that is pretty cute. And once I finish watching all of these, I don't know if you can really tell that it's glittery, but it is. And I'm just going to show you all of them.
on here is rubbing. Okay, oops, maybe if I turn it the way facing the camera on here, it is rubbing like it wants to do something. Let me just show y'all. It's like I'm ready. Put me on paper. Here we go. See, y'all. The way I know that something is legit, and I wish y'all could see my face, but I don't have no makeup on, so I'm not even going to go there today. I wish y'all could see my face right now, like I was saying, but the way you know something is alright is when the yellow shows up, okay? When the yellow shows up, you know you got something going. Now, what I should have did was grab some... You know what? We're just going to use this Planner Society paper so I can demonstrate the whites. So here we're going to go in with the white. And I like the white, y'all. Maybe I'm bonkers, but I love it. But watch. When light colors show pigmented on any color, even if it's just white on white, which it wouldn't show up anyway because it's not. Or maybe it's just silver. Oh, yeah, they're calling it white. So here we go. What I tell y'all? What I tell y'all, look at that. It almost kind of has a silver tint to it. I ain't even going to lie. I just had to do it again just so I can show y'all. Look at that. Look at that. Uh-huh. See? <sighs> I'm probably doing too much today. But look at that. I just messed it up. Whatever. It was already messed up. But like I said, look at the white on my skin. Dominique said I should use it as a highlighter and maybe I will try it one day as a, a tripod, which hopefully I can find a cheap one. I'm just going to blend this right here because even after these, now the thing about my color pencils in this, even after it dries, I can still go back in and blend if I wanted to. I'm just going to give y'all a close up on that right there that I just did because it's so cute. I'm gonna fold this in half. But look at that. Look at that. You cannot even tell the difference. So, like I said, and this almost kind of give off gives off a silver movie vibe. Look at the back. So it does go through. And again, that's just part of me using too much water. So don't sweat it, especially if you're trying. But look at how that looks, even if you just do. Now I just want to do one more thing because I just, I just, I, I don't know. I just feel like I want to. So look at that. Oh, I don't know what's the best look. Let's just try on my skin. Look at that. Look at that. That's cute. But that's not what I was about to do. <laughs> Y'all, I'm telling y'all, I we were talking about tax tests, and I'm sure every state has their, you know, exit level tests. We were talking about tax tests today, and I was like, man, I do not know how I used to get threes on my test, just because of the fact that the way this video is, y'all, is the same way I write my papers, a hot mess. There's 50 million stories all on one sheet of paper. So I'm just going to go back in. I just wanted to show y'all some of these colors that I love personally. Again, because I feel like that first swatch was nothing. Just color that out. But, okay, so I know y'all are like, oh, she's annoying. Let me hurry up. And there's that. So, I'm just going to leave that right here for my little backdrop, even though it's a hot mess. And here goes, um, like I said, this is my Chic Sparrow Pelican. Um, I'll do another flip through on this once I print out more inserts, which I plan on doing today. Um, probably make another video today, I don't know. Y'all, I tried it. I really did with this right here. And shout out to Dominique. She's like the hand lettering queen. Um, she's teaching us at my job. I kind of did a little bit today. But anyway, so I might go back and watercolor these monthlies from Love and Mako. And I want to put this down, y'all, but let me move this thing out of the way because it's still wet. But again, look at that color. I hope it's showing up. So, 
I think I tried to. See, the thing about me is when I get something or when I like something, I just try to do it on every single thing. So, these are just my watercolor pencils. Of course, you can tell because it's still, you can see the pen. So, this right here, I know I'm just trying to show the stuff, the metallic part. It's so cute, but what is it? A stick figure. So, I just thought this was so cute because this was just my grocery list for yesterday. Or to do this. This right here, it's pigmented, y'all. If it's pigmented, it's kind of in it. Okay, nothing on my hand. Nothing on my hand. I just rubbed two spots. So look at that. Yes, it does transfer. But who goes like this all day? And I can't lie, this is so cute. This right here, that purple... If you use a little bit, it kind of makes it look iridescent. I hope that is displaying on camera. Okay. And I kind of did like a fun little swatch. So, again, y'all can see how this blends. That is amazing. For the amount that it is, for $5.19, you cannot beat that. Let's see. It's starting to get a little dark, so I'm trying to hurry up. $5.19. Who said that? <laughs> um, but real quick, I'm just going to show you my stickers because I'm ready to use them. I got these from Rose Color Days. They are foil. Shout out to them. These are just the Rose Colored Heart Checklist. Heart checklist. I got three sheets. They were $12. They are pretty pretty pricey but I think these are the matte stickers don't quote me um but they're so cute I mean and I will never I mean I mean I plan every day but I don't think I will run out of checklist so I'm fine for a while so I can afford to spend the 12 dollars every blue moon just for three sticker sheets and look at these date head covers they're so cute I'm sorry y'all if I talk crazy, that's how we talk at work when we get new stuff. This is so cute, though. I'm so excited to use them. I was like, man, I cannot wait. I'm just trying to show y'all how pretty they are. I cannot wait until they get here. And I just got two different kinds. This was like the ocean, I think, is the color scheme. It was like ocean vibes. I didn't say vibes. It didn't say vibes, but you get to choose the color, like neutral, black, pink, um, and then neutral blacks pink neutral blues pink um and then you get to choose the color of your foil which i chose rose gold because what girl doesn't love rose gold well yes you guys that is it for today i will be back soon with another video like comment subscribe share because i'm trying to get my subscribers up and thank y'all y'all have a great rest of y'all's day